All right, you know what it's time for? Trending with Trent, that handsome devil. See what he's up to on this Friday to take us on into the weekend. Mwah. Hi, Trent. Thank you so much, CP. Good morning, and I so am much. kicking it off with, as you teased, the great Ina Garten, but before we get to her, let's go a little bit younger. She's been in the entertainment headlines since she was a little kid, back on, on Barney and her Disney show, and a lot of music since. Of course, I'm talking about yeah. Demi Lovato. Well, earlier this summer, she announced her engagement to Max Eric, another actor, but called it off just a couple months later. So, of course... She gets on all platforms, puts that heartbreak into music, and released Still Have Me, this heart-wrenching post-breakup ballad. Let's take a little listen. I don't have much money. That's all she needs, honey. Yes, Woo! She's rising up, the power Woo! in her voice. We're always supporting her. She's a big supporter of mental health and her journey and is always very open about that. Yeah. Rachel on Twitter shared, forever destroying me with her beautiful, emotional, did I say beautiful already? Music, we yeah. love that. Now let's go to a little <laughs> bit more seasoned couple. We love Ina Garten. She's been busy in 2020, honey. We saw her mix up a gorgeous Cosmo on Instagram. And we love her husband, Jeffrey. But by the way, let me give you a little teaser. She has a cookbook coming next week, Modern Comfort Food. Earlier this week, we celebrated Homemade Cookies Day. So if you follow at Ina Garten, you're going to see these gorgeous black and white cookies. But back to her marriage. Jeffrey is always on Barefoot Contessa, and they <laughs> loved this year because they've spent more time together than ever. They have such a unique okay. marriage. Yeah. They've worked in government together. He's a professor at Yale, but he's spending a lot more time in the Hamptons with her. They're cooking nonstop. And CP, the love is real, just like you and Jimbo. Well, now, Trent, the love is real, but we've only been together 14 years. 50, that's pretty incredible. By the way, guess what's on my printer as we speak? Her lemon chicken recipe. I might whip that out this weekend. <gasps> or mix it up, chicken. CP. I, I am. You and Jim it. are next. 52 years, baby. I'm going to do it, Trent. Oh, I love it. Thank you, Trent. And thank you guys for tuning in. Have the best weekend. I'll see you right back here on Monday.